hi guys in the last video we just uh, set up our source tree application and now for working further inside this source tree application we need to avail our projects on our local drive so to do that we just need to s sign in inside this bitbucket.org and first um, we will share the stack savings designer html1 or whatever the project will be by like this uh, so you don't know uh, you don't need to do this but i'm telling you like how will we just share it with you you will provide us your username or the email id email id which uh, you will use for sign up inside the bitbucket then we will share it with you after that you will see ins it inside this your dashboard like uh, if we share this one you will see this stack savings designer html1 after moving further uh, you will see inside there's a SSH key like git at the rate bitbucket and uh, the whole URL which is uniquely for this repository now you have to first copy it from in this the reason behind copying the, that URL is to you have to clone it clone in the sense like uh, you have to download the whole thing whatever inside the repository on your local drive so first you have to copy that and paste it over here and it will check the source that uh, does this really exist inside the bitbucket yes is it uh, it is exist like this is a git repository and you can just give this a path where you want to save inside the local drive like I'm doing this like this is designer html1 then you will select the folder okay so this one is set from now and uh, you just need to clone it will take uh, around uh, 5 10 minutes or maybe more depending on the size of the repository and the bandwidth that uh, you are receiving so when it will done we will move forward okay now you see the designer html1 the cloning system is now loading now wait it's just lo loading right now yeah it's loaded so now you see this is the designer one uh, designer one html this is uh, the path where you have Saved it, saved it inside your local drive like I saved it inside my this directory and this one is your project designer one HTML this is repository from the bitbucket okay so when you click on this file status uh, you have to open the explorer for this first and then there is branch it will show who committed what updates uh, at what time and like it will show like I Avidyal committed some changes over here on 22nd 21st Rick Dean did some changes or made some commitment so okay so now you have to click on file status working copy so in that you need to open in explorer okay so this one your designer html1 folder opened and now this is the landscape folder so which you have extracted from cloning process so this one folder over here is a dot git so you don't need to delete it because this is what actually tracking tracking everything inside the git the bit bit bucket so now let's do a change change some way inside the landscape okay so this is the file that I opened and uh, wait 
so this is the file that I open to make some changes now you can see I'm making a little changes over here so let's write something so I made a little change inside this style dot uh, txt file what in inside the no notepad so let's close it and inside this will show the yellow button over here the yellow marker it means uh, it is updated but not yet pulled pushed towards the bit bucket and uh, so now you just need to click on it and add for further uh, for further commitment uh, you have to click on commit button so it will make changes inside the bit bucket so first click on this commit button as you can see uh, it's my name over here Avi Deyal and uh, so you have to write something over here but uh, we recommend you write something according to the task like here in this uh, admin sent us the this task uh, designer HTML underscore uh, bug one so we copy of this and paste it over here so after this this is what is all about I mean what we are working on and then we will write what we have worked like I inserted a line in C SS style text file so you have to write it in a very brief note like what you did to make changes and you need to do the commit okay so you can see over here in branches in master file this uh, description is you can you see over here designer HTML one I inserted in CSS style dot text and uh, it is done by me Avi Deyal at this time so in this way we can get track of everything who which developer is doing what at what time so but the changes are right now it's under your local drive to make changes inside the bit bucket you need to do one more thing uh, you need to push so you see over here there is one notification like you this this means like uh, you have something one changes and you need to push it to get effect inside the bit bucket so we are clicking the push make sure it is tick master and you click ok so it's done now and uh, let's wait so your first commit is done now you can check from bitbucket to verify whether it's done correctly or not so I'm refreshing it it so I show seven hours ago but now it shows last update 20 seconds ago when I clicked over here okay so now this is all done so here you learned that how you can make changes and push it to the uh, bit bucket directory so in next video I will show how you can fetch the changes done by other designer and you create more changes inside that so let's do that after this video